What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, reliable AMT, make sure to hit up my sponsor and use code BUGS for 5% off checkout. Links down below in the description. Hit them up right now. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today we're going to go over the market in NBA 2K21 My Team. And guys, as you guys can see, I am officially broke, man. We are going to have to sell some cards and whatnot. We're going to go over the market, see if it is worth to sell some cards. So, before we get into the video, guys, make sure to smash that like button. It'd be greatly appreciated. The more likes we get on this video, the better videos we will drop. And also, we are going to do a giveaway on Thursday this week. So, make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram for that. And also, if you want MT, you want to buy MT, sell MT, hit me up on Twitter. I do buy and sell MT or Instagram. All in the description down below. But, yo, let's get into the market. You guys have been loving the market talk videos, so let's get into it, man. Um, we're going to go over a couple cards. As you guys can see, there's not a lot of market movement. That means there's not a lot of people playing the game today, probably because there is no content in which Friday, usually there is a market crash. So guys, the market is honestly low key rising with Brandon Roy being at 112. Manu Ginobili is going to go up in value. Honestly, I think it's almost time to sell your Manus. He didn't go up as much as I expected. He maybe will go up in the next week or so, but I'm going to hold on to mine for now. Um, let's go over some other cards. Let's go over Michael Cooper. Let's go over some Ami 20s, guys. Ami 20s are a must sell. If you guys did get your Ami 20 players, make sure to sell them, man. Going over Michael Cooper. Let's see if he is worth the sell right now. And honestly, if you guys did get him for 8K, you want to make your quick MT. Honestly, now might be the time to sell. It looks like he's around 10,500. So if you got him for 8,000 MT and under, you sell him for 10,500, you're going to make about 1,000 um so let's say 10,500 minus minus a thousand so 9400 you'll make about 1400 per michael cooper so if you want to sell now it's not a bad idea i got all mine for a, a, like 7,000 and under eight i think 7500 and under so i did scoop a couple if you want make sure to sell him and i'm going to show you some snipe filters in this video too to make you guys some mt um let's check out the ami 20 filter see what's going on here harden for 14k that's a pretty good value uh, actually, no, his price is down. So, guys, <clears throat> everything is honestly kind of down in value, which means these cards are most likely not going to rise for a little bit. So, if I were you, I would honestly sell all your cards. It seems like there's going to be better content coming. Market crash is most definitely going to come. So, most likely tomorrow, we're going to see a market crash. If I were you guys, I, not tomorrow, the next day, Friday, we're going to see a constant market drop, honestly, from here on here, day in, day out. So right now, guys, it looks like every single card in the game has been shifted in value. There hasn't really been a rise too much this week. A little tiny one, nothing too crazy, but it's definitely a good time to sell. And that's all I'm going to say. Christos Porzingis is up there to 55,000 MT. He's most definitely a sell right now, guys. He's going to drop in value by Friday easily, guys. So if you want to sell your cards today, it's completely up to you. I would say either today or tomorrow maybe tomorrow would be better i think i'm gonna sell all my cards tomorrow hopefully there isn't a premature market crash and let's check out some badges man um i heard a lot of hall of fame badges are up there in value can you even sell hall of fame badges i don't even think you can you can sell oh you cannot sell hall of fame badges so i'm mistaking myself but yo a lot of these badges guys if you have them sitting in your collection make sure to sell them guys if you have range extender man you might have range extender sitting in your collection don't use it guys just sell your range extender that is the best thing you could possibly do let's just go over range extender real quick it's going for a crazy amount guys bronze range extender is up there in value guys range extender also clamps if you guys have clamps make sure to get rid of clamps pretty much any badge that makes sense is going to go for a lot of mt me personally i'm going to start selling a lot as many badges as i can and also man let's check out how much Giannis is going for and he's up to 170,000 mt so guys if you have mr Giannis on tentacupo try to get rid of him as you guys can see there's not a lot posted today if i were you there is a lot of cards that are going for bid that are barely posted and i think it's a very good time to sell these cards and here are some snipe filters, man. We're going to get into some snipe filters. Pink diamond filter at 500, guys. This filter's cash. You get Dominique. You get Brandon, um, Brandon Roy. 
and Mono Ginobili. It might be different on PS4, I my bad, but on Xbox, this is a very good filter. Next filter, guys. This one's pretty good. You need to have a little bit of more MC. But here it is. It's Diamond Easter, man. All you need to buy is Alonzo Morning, really. You really don't even need to buy cards. It is a little bit of scrolling, but on this filter, guys, you get Allen Iverson, Larry Bird, and Giannis. So you never know which ones you get. Either way, you're going to make MT. So definitely try this one out. It's pretty good. And also, there is a Western one, but Deron Williams did kind of destroy it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to enable them right there a Mark Eaton for 100K. I'm going to check what he goes for. I'm pretty sure he's a pretty decent amount. And, ah, actually, never mind. He's actually about 100K. But that filter right there, since I do have Deron Williams, you could get um, Paul George. And there's a couple other cards. John Stockton, Kevin Durant. All for a buy now. And Lamar Odom and Steve Nash. So, guys, if you're on this filter, man, definitely try it out. I do have Deron Williams in my collection. I know for a fact he's not that expensive on PS4. So definitely try out this method. You never know what's going to pop up. And honestly, Mark Eaton for 100K, guys, this card's a beast, man. I know he's not the best shooter, but he's so tall and he's going to change the game. So if I were you, definitely try to scoop that up. 100K is not a bad value at all for this man. This filter is definitely very, very good. Um, let's get into the next night filter, guys. This one is for someone with the range of MT that I have right now, man. We got to get that MC up. We haven't been on the game. We've been working recently, so... Definitely I'm gonna go over this real quick. So Ruby filter man. That's a snipe right there for 2k Paul George This filter man if you guys have any rubies if you invested in Brian Scalabrine Especially man all the rubies are up in value. So me personally, I would definitely recommend selling your rubies They're up big time the markets honestly rising big time only certain cards aren't but a lot of cards are so it's completely up to you on how you want to actually view this market right now me personally i don't think it's a bad day to sell realistically even if you didn't make that much profit it's probably the safest day to sell you don't want to wait really that much longer you never know what's going to come friday and you need mt for friday because friday is the day to snipe friday is the day to go crazy so realistically if i were you man get rid of any of your investments like these eric gordons i got for 1400 you should easily sell these cards. These are easy sell cards. They're going to sell. You're going to make nothing crazy about 800 MT per card, 600 MT per card, whatever you want to do. Make sure to get rid of your cards. Honestly, seems like a good day today. Doesn't seem like the market is going to go up at all. But right now, man, Ruby Snipe Filter, uh, Ami 20 Snipe Filter, these filters should be going crazy right now. It should be easier too because there's not a lot of people on the game, especially with the whole update thing going on right now and the trash, trash new patch. But yo guys, other than that, that's really all I got for the video. Pretty much just gave you all my knowledge on the market. If you guys have any questions, make sure to let me know down below. And honestly, before we do end it, let's go over a couple other snipe filters, man, for you guys. Let's go right here. <clears throat> this filter is perfect for my MT range right now. Uh, but yeah, 650, that, that's a good value. That's a good value, man. Of course, we're going to miss it. But yo, here's the thing. If you actually get these cards, you're going to make a solid amount of MT. This snipe filter right here, it's going to make you MT. I promise you. I promise you. Just try it out. You never know what could pop up. It could be a pink diamond. It could be a diamond. It could be an amethyst. You never know. I've seen millions of people, not millions, but I've seen a lot of people snipe pink diamonds for this value. It makes no sense. I understand. But you never know in this day and age of 2K, man. Crazy people are out there. And I'm going to show you one more snipe filter, man. We got diamond around the cheapest possible diamond to pop up. Snipe filter. So diamonds are actually up in value, guys. Diamonds are up big time. Um, let's see. Diamond. 74K. So here we go. This snipe filter right here. Diamonds are up a lot. If you guys want the cheapest diamond to pop up, pretty much any single diamond that pops up. Other than Alonzo Morning, unless it is very cheap for like 50k, you want to pick it up. This is one more snipe filter I wanted to show you before I ended the video. And yo, that's all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed. Smash that sub button, like it up, show some support, member up, all that good stuff. You need MT, hit me up. That's all I got for the video. Have a good one. Peace. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure you hit me up on Instagram and Twitter. I am buying and selling MT. Hit me up right now.